Today we're going to be talking about society and culture and some of the tasks and creative activities we've been doing in the classroom. We've actually been applying our content knowledge into a more creative sphere. So we have been engaging in blackout poetry and blackout poetry is a form of poetry where students are given text from magazines, newspapers or any form of written text where they literally black out and cross out words that don't necessarily reflect the statement that, or the poem that they wish to express. We looked at the five fundamental concepts as a part of the society and culture syllabus. So we were looking at society, persons, culture, environment and time. And each student was asked to run with one of those uh, ideas. And basically what they did was create a poem alongside expressing their creative side through drawing and illustrating to accompany the, the text that they were presenting. My main goal has been for students to be able to access the content and really absorb the content and express their understanding in the most creative way possible. That was the intention of this task. We can all regurgitate content, but the idea is to assess how students have absorbed this information and how they can actually express their understanding. With society and culture, for me, it has been incredible to teach this course because the students have brought in a lot of their own experiences into the classroom and oftentimes we extend on the theory and the content through drawing out personal examples. I mean, I find I give a lot of personal examples from my career, you know, my family structure and, and examples there where I can ensure that students are getting a more in-depth insight into how the content relates to real life. I've been using blackout poetry in multiple disciplines and it's great to see how fun and how interactive this task actually is. I guess the most exciting part for me was having students share their work and talk about what they were actually expressing in their written and illustrative pieces. It was a creative way of assessing student learning and the depth of the knowledge that they've gained from the content we explored in class.